How would you calculate the area of this circle? Probably using the formula A equals pi r square. Since the diameter is 2 feet, r the radius is 1 foot. The constant pi is about 3.14. So, A equals pi r square equals 3.14 times 1 times 1 equals 3.14 square feet. Let's explore how people figured out circle areas before all this pi business. The ancient Egyptians had a fascinating method that produces answers remarkably close to the formula using pi. The Egyptian octagon method. Draw a square around the circle just touching it at four points. What's the area of the square? Well, it measures 2 by 2. So, the area equals 4 square feet. Now, we divide the square into 9 equal smaller squares. Sort of like a tic-tac-toe game. Note that each small square is one ninth the area of the large one. We'll use that fact later. Finally, we draw lines to divide the small squares into the corners and half, cutting them on their diagonals. Note the eight-sided shape and octagon we have created. Note also that its area looks pretty close to that of our circle. The Egyptians were very handy at finding the area of this octagon. After all, this little square has an area of one ninth of the big one, and so do these four others. And each corner piece is, one, is half of one ninth or one eighteenth of the big one. And altogether, we've got four pieces that are one eighteenth or four eighteenths, which is two ninths, plus five more one ninth, for a total area that is seven ninth of our original big square. Finally, yep, we're almost done. We have an octagon with an area equal 7 ninths of the original square. The original square had an area of 7 square feet, so the octagon's area must be 7 ninths multiplied by 4, or 28 ninths, or 3 and 1 ninth. Or 3 and 1 ninth, or about 3 points. One, one square feet amazingly close to the by based modern calculation for the circle the hexagon area 3.11 square feet the circle area 3.14 square feet only about 0.03 of about a one percentage error <laughs>